Hi guys, in this tutorial I'll show you how to create a chrome car effect in After Effects. Let's get started. First select the Roto Brush tool and double click on your clip. Then start rotoscoping the car as smoothly as possible to isolate it from the background. Once you're done, click the freeze button. After the freezing is complete, close the rotoscoping window. Now we need another layer with the inverted selection. To do that, first duplicate your layer. Then rename the top layer to car only and toggle it off, since we no longer need to see it. Now select the bottom layer, make sure the roto brush tool is selected, and double click on the layer to start rotoscoping again. Since we already have the car rotoscoped, we can simply invert the selection. First unfreeze the current selection, then check invert foreground slash background. Now the selection is fully inverted. Click the freeze button again and wait for it to finish. Once it's done, close the rotoscoping window. Duplicate the bottom layer and select the very bottom one. Press P on your keyboard to reveal the position property. Then adjust the Y position until the black car area is filled with either the road or the sky, depending on which direction you move it. Once that's done, select both bottom layers and pre-compose them into a single layer. To stay organized, I'll name it Effect. Make sure move all attributes and adjust composition duration are selected, then click OK. Now on the effect layer, apply the Displacer Pro plugin. Displacer Pro is completely free. Check this video's description to download it from the official website, change the map layer from none to the car only layer, the one we previously toggled off. Then set the source to effects and masks. Now adjust the translate Y value until your car looks like the mirror, around 130 should be fine. Next change edge behavior to edge repeat, and set anti-aliasing to 4x for better quality. And that's it, we can now check the final result. Hope you found this video helpful, thanks for watching and if you enjoyed it, please give it a like.